Today, I'm on a secret mission, so to speak. And with that, a very warm welcome to Intersolar TV. The official opening of the Intersolar Europe 2012 on the 13th of June is still a bit away, but the world's largest exhibition for solar technology still offers a lot of topics for conversation, and not only in the industry. I'm not currently in Munich, but at the Frankfurt Square Conference Center. The jury will meet here today for the most important prize in the industry, the Intersolar Award. Let's see, maybe even before the start of the Intersolar Europe, I can reveal one or two of the award winners. This group makes trends out of ideas. The photovoltaic experts discuss the best entries and decide who shall shine in 2012 like the previous year's winners. The Intersolar Award has long been the trend barometer for the industry. At the same time, the Glass Trophy celebrates its fifth anniversary this year. In this time, a lot has changed and the jury knows this all too well, as they always keep the industry firmly in mind. You're an experienced jury member. You've been doing this for a few years now. What were your highlights when you think back? What surprised me most this year was the range of themes that were submitted. They show a very broad spectrum of ideas. The quality of the entries has improved significantly. We have received submissions from the entire value-added chain, from the cell to grid integration. What are the highlights, the technical trends, what direction is it going in? Photovoltaics has two main tasks for the future. One is cost reduction and another is grid integration. I think these points will be the highlights of this year's exhibition. Not only in terms of photovoltaics, but also solar thermal and PV production technology. The organizers once again nominate the most imaginative winner. For the fifth anniversary, a new category has also been added. Solar projects in North America. The award ceremony takes place on the 10th of July as part of the InterSolar North America. What significance do you think this special prize has gained in the solar industry? It has a great significance in the industry. I think the main reason is because it's a neutral evaluation of the products and you can easily use it to attract customers or for marketing purposes. The most important criterion is the degree of innovation. It must really be a unique idea, but that's not all. The idea must be implemented and presented as a product at the Intersolar. It must be documented and have a proven benefit for society, for the industry and ultimately for the customer. Only then does it fulfill all the criteria. As you know, I host the ceremony, so I need to know who you've chosen so I can be prepared. I'm afraid I have to ask you to be patient. We're in the process of deciding. We've identified some clear favorites, but of course, I can't give away any names yet. Well, too bad. But it's also a huge advantage, as it will remain exciting. And secondly, of course, we have a great reason to attend this fantastic award ceremony, because the curtain will certainly fall. Other than that, we will make detailed and comprehensive reports again for you at the Intersolar Europe 2012. Till then, or at least till June, have a sunny time. All the best. Goodbye. Cheers.